The RSA 5000N and the RSA 3000N need to be calibrated before performing an S11, S21, or distance default measurement to ensure each measurement's accuracy. We sell two different calibration kits. The CK106A has a frequency range from DC to 6.5 GHz, and the CK106E has a frequency range from DC to 1.5 GHz. Before you calibrate your instrument to perform S11, S21, or distance default measurements, what you first want to do is set your frequency range and your span of your desired measurement. And every time you want to change your frequency range and span, you're going to have to recalibrate the instrument for that test. So once we've done that, S11 and distance default calibration are exactly the same. First, what you want to do is enter the measurement setup mode, and then you want to press clear to clear out pre-existing calibration data, and then you want to go into the align menu. And once within there, you want to take the calibration kit adapters and put them on the output port, or this port on your spectrum analyzer, and once they're screwed on, you just want to press the button with the corresponding adapter. And once that's been connected, you can unscrew it and connect the next one. The next one's short for this one, and then it'll finish. And then finally our load. And then once that's been calibrated, we can press done and exit out of our menu. And now we're ready to take our measurements on our S11 setting. And now, if we want to then switch the distance default or S21, we'd have to recalibrate for each test. But the S11 currently is calibrated, and the distance default measurement are going to look exactly the same way the calibrated. Now, to calibrate the S21, you first want to go in here, and once again, make certain you've got your frequency set right, and then press clear. And then once you've done that, connect your line, and now take your through. And for this case, I'm just going to use a through cable. But say you're testing a filter that you've got a split in the middle or two cables, there's a through adapter in the calibration kit that allow you to connect them here in the middle. And once that's connected, you can press through. That'll calibrate and then be done. And then at this point, you're now calibrated for your S21 measurements.